I, I'm, I'm <laughs> like 90% sure it was a Reeves. Yeah. <laughs> it was, it was, uh, was I, was, Reeves. I was hoping you would know the name, but uh, no, I, thought, uh, I thought you followed all, every single one of his matches, man. I thought you were his coach. I thought you were just there. And so I You're asleep. You know, wait, come on, Kitaro. <laughs> <laughs> and here we go. We have. Um, I know he did lose to um, AC earlier. Um, I was helping him practice uh, Falco versus um, Marth. But I kept saying, like, just so you know, he does have a Meta Knight, and MKLeo did lose to Tyrant before. So good stuff to AC. I think they that. did a Meta Knight ditto as well, too. Yeah. Yeah. Pretty crazy. Anyway, game number one Nico versus Trella. Uh, first here, Trella on the left side playing Ryu, but uh, yeah, I'm sure you know who's playing who. Yeah. All right. Committing a little too hard with the Hadouken. Yeah, I don't know. What do, you, what do you think about this matchup? Again, show not a character we see very often. Uh, even Ryu, honestly, not a character we see that often. I feel that it should be. I, I feel like it should be in the Shulk's favor due to the fact that he can just out camp Ryu or be more defensive and not let Ryu approach him. Yeah, Ryu is going to have a very hard time making his way in there, but once he gets in there, I feel like he's going to be able to get that big damage we very often see coming out from Ryu. We see a lot of up tilts coming out. God forbid he has Shield Monado Art on deck when he, you know, he gets hit by a tag by an up tilt. Oh, that actually should have been it, but it looks like he did a mistake in the Ryu. I have not seen like such high level Ryu in quite a while, so it's very interesting to see how um, his movement is. Yeah, I think he's kind of in not as bad, but maybe in a similar situation to Shulk, where there's a lot of micromanagement with this character. It's not as easy as just pressing buttons anymore, you know? Now you got, you got real inputs, you got big boy inputs. All he needs is a down tilt to up beat. Oh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, that works out too. <laughs> Doesn't try to get the KO, but probably put some fear in Nico's heart as we see him kind of retreat to that platform. Ryu almost always has stage has stage control in this uh, game, due to the fact that people are scared. Once they get Ryu in the air, they're more okay with it. Mm. But <laughs> once he has you at KO percent, they're just always running around on the platforms. Wow. And that might be it. Yep. Yeah. Again, Ryu. Yeah, he, uh, he does have a lot of recovery options, but a lot, you know that a lot of them are kind of slow. If, if he's still recovering from horizontally, uh, that Tatsu is, <laughs> is going to get punished or trade. Looking for that backer. Looking for the up air, and another backer comes out. Wow, Ooh, and that's enough to do it across the stage. Jeez. Wow, Nico actually playing pretty aggressive this time around. Oh, just completely, you just stay blocking it. That's actually pretty rare. I see uh, Trello going for grabs, too. Yeah, kind of unfortunate thing for Shulk. Doesn't have many multi-hit attacks in the air, so I think we're going to see that focus attack coming, uh, coming in handy. Oh, yeah, that's why he's probably always using the focus attack, knowing he can just escape to that due to Shulk having so much lag on his attacks and so much late startup, too, on many of his uh, aerial attacks. Yeah, late startup really is a killer for Shulk. Uh, you know, recovery's not too bad. I always say this, recovery's not too bad, but that startup <laughs> is really what hurts him. <laughs> that rolling, very nice by Trella, but he's still having trouble getting in. Oh, I like how he side beat to the stage instead of going for the up beat. Has to watch out with those air dodges. Yeah, so Nico all over him being very, very aggressive, even though uh, Trilla not too far behind. And, good choice. Wow, and he's at KO percent. Oh my god! Oh wait, yep, that TSRK not gonna do it with Shield Monado art. Very nice, adding up the damage. Shield Monado still out, still out, still out. Doesn't even go for the up B, knowing that, or Shoryuken, knowing that it's not gonna KO just yet. He might be able to live. Does he even jump? Yep, he does. Oh, okay. Good stuff saving that. Oh, oh and the up B <laughs> will do it. I, wow. That's, uh, you, you know, Nico was looking for like a, a falling there or falling or anything, really, that would have traded and just sent Ryu in a bad position, but doesn't quite get it. Yeah, I think uh, Nico went a little too aggressive when he decided to go off again to try to get the. He was either fair or neutral air, mm. and that's where he got punished for grabbing the ledge twice. So good stuff to Trello, seeing through that, getting the up beat to hit. We'll see what stage we go to. That was Smashville. I have a feeling we'll just see Smashville again. Actually, we're going to Final Destination. Either way, the very close first match. Uh, I feel like this could go either way. Definitely. Not getting too crazy with the counter fix. Yeah, not too much running away either. It's a little shocking to see. Ryu does actually run pretty fast on the ground. Yeah, I think for the most part, Nico can kind of set the pace of this match. Of course, with that shield, I'm not sorry, not shield, uh, speed and jump Monado art. Really going to be a lot of Trilla trying to keep up with him. Ooh, not, not Buster. Not, oh <laughs> this damage God. he's going to take from this. <laughs> Very beautiful. 88%? My goodness. All right, looking around for that grab. Okay, Trilla actually going for the grabs this time around, and he got it to work. Yeah, it seems like both players playing very patient and neutral. Oh. Uh, yeah, not so many attacks coming out, especially from Trella. He's like just trying to bait Shulk to possibly run in and do something um, not good, so he can be able to punish with the Shoryuken. Oh. 
I love that Nico, uh, you know, playing great footsies against Trello, keeping those uh, aerial attacks just out of his distance. Oh my, Shield Monado helps him not go as far, so he's just able to keep up tilting. Oh, oh and he's seen the future. The future is a KO for Nico, putting himself on the board. A uh, 94%, really not too bad for him. Yeah. Uh, Ryu does hit hard though, so. Oh my Ooh. god! Oh my god. <laughs> yeah. it, it looks it, like he can see the future too. My god, <laughs> yo, he definitely saw the future. On I that feel one. like a pixel towards the left, and he would have landed on stage instead of towards that blast zone. But uh, he <laughs> see through that. <laughs> Don't Man. jump up there. That my was god. So well, good stuff to Trello on that one. Bring it right back. Every time he gets KO'd, he just gets a KO back immediately. Very nice combos coming out from Trello. Oh my gosh! And, uh, uh, taking all this damage in Buster too, 63% from the exchange, and that's, uh, man, Trail to put himself back in the game with that. <laughs> Make sure you tech against Ryu, he could block you also. Yep, that's going to be damage, and that's perfect percent to actually KO Shulk. He needs to go in the shield, and here it is, so he can live a little bit longer. Once he's like, oh, oh really, really <laughs> wanted that, I, I respect it. You know, that would have been a good damage, I don't think it would have got the KO, because he was in shield, not art. Just doing an up tilt to get some. Oh my gosh, went for the shore you can anyway. Last Trello even looking for that KO. He knows the shield. <laughs> he knows he has less knockback, but he knows how strong that, that uh, true shore you can is. All right, and there's no shield model, and the shield model's back again. See the future. Once again, the future has been seen. It's not going to be enough for the KO just yet. Oh wow. Looks like. Uh, Okay, and that actually should be oh, KO anyway. Even with the Shield Monado art. That is how strong the attack is, Kitaro. Wow, good stuff to Trello for taking the second game on FD. So I'm surprised we didn't see a stage of platforms for him to be able to just run away a little more. Maybe he doesn't care about running away against Ryu, so he just wants an open field where he can just uh, punish Ryu's landings. I, I felt like that actually might be a good option. Shout out to the boy. Tremendo dude, Shulk Players Unites. Tremendo dude coming out with the advice for Nico. Amazing teacher, amazing dancer. You know, all the, did you see him last night? I didn't see him last night. Was he oh, Was he going in? Check my Twitter. Oh, I'll check your yeah, Twitter. Check my Twitter. <laughs> he was going in. Uh, that's good to know. All right. I'll so. just keep tabs on who the best dancers are, man. Have you seen PP and J? PP and J? He went in. He went Oh, he in. always goes. Wait, last night? Last night, yeah. Well, speaking of going in, it looks like they're going to be going in to Final Destination. I appreciate as that segue. <laughs> good job, Kitaro. <laughs> Got to keep you on your toes, man. <laughs> Game number the three will be Final Destination right once now. again. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, starting out with Speed Monado this time. This is interesting. Instead of uh, Buster Art Monado. Yeah, again, I wonder if he's realized, you know, from the first two games, being aggressive, not helping out too much. Maybe I should start, or, you know, at least try being a little bit more defensive, like you were talking about. Uh, staying outside of his range, just kind of running away from him. Oh my gosh, almost get punished for that. Wow, he's doing fantastic this time around. I think the key issue is getting the KO. I feel like he struggles to get that a little bit, and he allows Ryu to come back with a lot of damage or a lot of combos. Yeah, as you're looking for that KO attack, you put yourself in a situation where, you know, uh, you can get punished really hard for things. And that's what we've seen Trello do a lot. A lot of playing from behind, a lot of catching up and getting that early KO with TSRK. That was a beautiful retreat. And it might be a little hard for him to come back because it's really easy to punish the side B, but he has to side B, otherwise he won't be able to recover. Oh, he actually had his second jump, too. Yeah, Trailer always saving his jump, man. Jeez. He knows the Ryu metagame. It's almost like he has... His, oh, my. <laughs> See into the future again. Man, once again, I, I, these are more counters I've seen from him, like any shield player. Oh, a little <laughs> bit. A, held on to a focus attack a little bit too long. Wow. So this is looking similar to the last couple matches, or last two matches, where um, Sneeko would actually get the first KO, but then... Trello would immediately get a KO afterwards. Let's see if it'll be the same way. All right, using a speed Monado so well. Tremendous dude, good stuff giving that advice. That's again, great, uh, you know, great spacing and footsies coming off of Nico. We see Trello really having a hard time getting his way in there, uh, getting in there. Oh my lord, what is that? <laughs> yeah, I honestly, I guess he was in shield, so he didn't look uh, for the sure again instantly. Like I thought he was going to, but uh, <laughs> any damage is good damage once again. <laughs> The classic up tilt, up tilt into down air. It's up to Trello for seeing through that, or seeing through the second jump that Nico decided to use. And this man really dropped from the angel platform with backslash. I respect it. Gotta, gotta see it come out sometime. Speed Monado. Speed Monado. Oh, side B forced. And yeah, reading that air dodge. Oh! 
<laughs> a striking bag just like, you know, Komei versus Fatality. If you get spikes, you gotta spike him back and let him know. Let him know. It's not just me. <laughs> oh, he let him know. He, he let, let him know, know. I'm sure. <laughs> well, good stuff seeing through that. I see he's taking more advantage of forcing Ryu to go way off the stage using the fares and then forcing the side B. That's yeah. a good choice. Um, good stuff to him by that. But we have Battlefield coming up, so this will be a huge change in stage choice for this matchup. And yeah, to play on what you just said, a lot of that matchup was Trella trying to recover, trying to get his feet, his feet back on the stage. It wasn't working out too great for him, but uh, hopefully he can do better in this match. All right, already 31%, not looking too good. It's going to be a little harder to run away with these uh, platforms as a different escape option for uh, Ryu, actually. So like, it's going to be hard for him to actually approach with his shield Monado. So he goes into Buster Monado art. Yeah, look at this. There's an impenetrable wall of aerials and hitboxes. Trailer really having a hard time making his way in there. Looks si very similar situation. We've seen this yep. many times before. How is this going to end? How is this going to end? Does he have his jump? He's been known for saving it. Yep, saving it. Oh but my goodness. Trades with that dare. No amount of jumps is going to save you from that. Who trades with that? <laughs> <laughs> okay, good stuff to him, though. He has a much better lead than he's had um, the last time around. And here we, we hear the crowd chanting for Nico. Uh, you know, he's, been, he's down one game, but in a good situation in this game number four. Ooh. Very tricky from Trello right there. Using the fully charge of the focus attack and still able to punish afterwards. Man, quick shout out to whatever advice Tremendo can hit him with because it's been working out pretty <laughs> well for him so far. I definitely think the choice to use speed against Ryu a lot more often was very good. Oh, that's weird. Oh, no. Punish punished. coming off from Trilla. Just barely missed that up tilt because of uh, Nico's shrinking hurt box. This might be it. Oh, no. Actually. I guess man. he thought he would drop down low for fastball. Instead, he decided to side beat to the ledge. Good choice by uh, Trilla. He has a shield Nato, making sure he doesn't get the KO, even with all this rage. It's going to go off. He's going to see Trello off stage in most of this match. Wow. Oh, there it is. There's that multi hit. He doesn't have many of them, <laughs> but that up air is going to be a multi hit, able to go through focus attack and send us to game number five. Nico with the nod. Very, very straight face. All right, so I feel like he needs to go for those dares. I feel like he's winning because of those dares. Like, obviously, it's a change of play style uh -huh. that he's doing using the speed Monado. It's working out good, but getting those dares to work, uh, it's pretty much been a game changer right now. Absolutely. Game number five between these two players. Uh, these choke players are putting in work. This event, man, both of them uh, in winners right now. And Nico, one game away from staying in winners. Trilla, of course, going to try and fight back and not have to go into that shark pit of uh, you know, a loser's bracket. Wow. That was pretty impressive. I feel like um, we might see a different stage choice coming out from Trilla. He went to Battlefield. Probably that's the stage he feels comfortable on. But that was a clean win. Actually, cleaner win than um, the last win for Nico. So we might see a stage choice uh, change. Still thinking about it. Oh, it looks like uh, if I if I could read lips correctly, I think he said it. I think I'll go back to Battlefield. No, oh, interesting. I didn't realize you had that ability. Had a uh, lip reading ability. Yeah. Yeah, I have a lot of. I have like the seventh sense, man. Seventh sense. Yeah, you ever seen the movie? <laughs> I haven't seen that movie. Are you talking about Sixth Sense, maybe? Yeah, but there's a new one coming out. Oh, the sequel. Yeah, I'm in it. <laughs> so here we go. We're going back to Battlefield. <laughs> back to Battlefield for our game number five. Contrella and Nico worked out very very well. Uh, you know, last time we saw the stage. Let's see if we can do it again. Speed Monado coming out from the start once again. Wow. <laughs> that quick run and grab. It seems like Charles is just having trouble approaching. Before he was able to get his own grabs, but this time around it's looking a lot harder. All right, jump Monado. And he's going to Buster. Yeah, Buster right before he gets hit. That's <laughs> not, not too good. Renigo uh, Charles looked like he read that roll away, but wasn't able to catch him with the dash attack. We might have to go back to speed Monado. See, yeah, there we go. It seems like Buster is not working out good for him. Every time he goes into that, he seems to lose the early lead that he has. And I feel like most of the matches we've seen Nico take, uh, he has not been Buster. It's been shield. Uh, I'm sorry, it's been speed and, and jump. Oh! You better watch it. <laughs> it's just a statement, man. He doesn't get the KO, but uh, make him feel bad. He can dare you from the middle of the stage and KO you. <laughs> All right, should not a good choice, but it's going to run out pretty soon. And even so, I feel like it might not matter too much after a while. You should still be able to get the sure you can tell. Oh, what? He's uh, there. Oh, I, I like how you look for that falling up here after that. Oh my gosh. Jump, Monado? Oof. And oh. uh, Charlie going to return to stage with that focus attack. We saw hit the focus attack lose to up, up air, you know, last game. Surprising to see him still confident in that. A little shocked to see him in this Monado right now. I guess he won't get KO'd by other moves. Or uh, the only one that can KO him is sure you can. 
and oh, oh, he misses the strong part of the Shoryuken. Yeah, it looked, that was weird. He'd like dash up, reverse the Shoryuken. Maybe he missed it. What? That it's, move is ridiculous. It's unbelievable how strong that attack is. Even Nico going to hang on to the Angel platform to, you know, to kind of slow down the momentum he got from that. It's hilarious because it looks like Ryu's swatting a fly and you just go flying. It looks like he's flexing. Like he just <laughs> yeah. flexes and you die. All right, good back air, but he will need the Smash Monado to get a KO pretty soon. Looking for the up tilt, back air, and... Like that, gonna go into a Smash, a Smash Art. Wait for the air dodge? Oh. He saw through the air dodge, but it looked like Trello air dodge a little late on purpose. Yeah, oh. Trello was in that situation many, many times last game of the game before that, so I'm sure he's adjusted. Oh my gosh. This is the troublesome part about facing Ryu. He is at KO percent. And he decides to go Smash Yeah, he's gonna go Smash <laughs> Monado Art, so that's very scary. A <laughs> down for it all. A down to the Shuriken would have been it. Oh my gosh, okay. And he switched back to speed, but he speeded right into how <laughs> Up tilt, up tilt. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, forward air. Don't see that one very often. Okay, good choice. Got the back air. Back and air. now he'll probably need to stick or go back to Shield Monado and run away for quite a bit. My dude needs to go in the Buster and go all in right now. That's what he needs to do. <laughs> That's wild. Will he go for it? I feel like he'll just go for I don't speed think he's Monado. Go for yeah, it. I feel like he'll <laughs> no. go with the speed Monado after this and just try to run away and stay alive as long as he can. Yeah, I but think if he goes for Buster, I want to see it. I think he's going to try to get Trello off stage in that situation we saw many, many times and just go for the edge guard. Doesn't matter what percent Trello is at, you know, 24 to 240. Uh, you know, forward airs, couple forward airs off stage will do it for his stop. Good choice. Going back into shield. Running away just for a little bit. That's the Shulk Classic running away with Jump Monado on the platforms for a little bit. And then the Did he, I think he used his jump. Oh, I think oh he used his jump. Gosh. Oh, my oh. gosh. Oh, oh, wow. The shout outs to the Magnet Hands. We'll save him. 182 cannot get hit by anything here. Oh, my gosh. He needs to go back to shield Monado pretty soon. He's there, but he still can get sure you can. Yeah, he's, he can still absolutely get hit by something here at 192 and lose his stock. Wow, Trella trying to bait the rolls. And Nico's actually rolling quite a bit. Another roll. Phil saying very patient. And he knows the shield Monado art has to run out sometime, and there it is. Oh, run away, run away. Yeah, he's like, <laughs> don't even approach. I don't even think Nico ah! wants to play right now. We see Trello <laughs> read that with a run out. Sure, you can. And close out game number five. Wow, there were a lot of rolls coming out from Nico, and I think Trello was just waiting for it. That's one thing I noticed about Trello's play style. He's always waiting for a roll, and Nico was rolling a bit too much. He saw through it. It doesn't matter how fast you run. Do you blame him though? This man was sitting at over 200%, just lost his shield, not an art. <laughs> set. Ryu. He was just trying to get out of that situation. He was trying to make a, create as much space between those two characters as he could. Uh, unfortunately, Trella reading that and closing out that game number five, that was, uh, that was a great.